Hey guys, welcome to Dancing with the Stars Diaries. Today I'm sitting down, seeing as it's been such a crazy week, right, Corky? Yes. It, it has been, right? Full of drama. So this is Corky Ballas, for those of you that don't know. Hello. This is Mark's dad. Um, you also have been on the show. Yes, I have. As a pro. So he definitely knows what everyone's going through on the show, that's for sure. How's Derek doing? Is he um, okay? Derek is, is, a, is, he is as okay as okay can be. Mm. He's, he's healing and uh, that takes time. It was crazy. It just happened all in about 30 seconds. It was, it was I know. the last take of a rehearsal and, you know, he, he kicked the, he kicked the light by accident. Thought he broke his toe and then five seconds later he's going to get ice and then he double sprains the other foot so he is laid up in bed right now as we speak. Oh bless him. Well I know everyone is worried about him so yeah. we just wanted to check in. You performed on the 10 year anniversary episode which is going to be airing next week on Tuesday. Tuesday right. the 28th. Nice. April 28th. So you danced on that. Who are you dancing with? I did. With? I, I, I did. I didn't dance with my celebrity. I, you know, I, before I danced with uh, Floris Leachman, which is probably now 92, I think, and Florence. Wow. So I danced actually with Mark. I did a little piece with Mark, and then I danced with Allison. So yeah, yeah you'll see me throughout the 10th anniversary show. I'm, I'm in and out of there. Nice. So what do you think of this season then? Uh, I think we have a great season. Yeah. I mean, I think the show actually seeing the 10th anniversary made me realize just how. Uh, just what a great show Dancing with the Stars is. I mean, what other show on the earth does what this show does? I mean, all the celebrities that have come back over the 10 years, they were sitting in the audience. Just amazing, really. The, cl the closing of the show is also pretty iconic. Patti LaBelle sings uh, Lady Marmalade, which is uh, oh, wow. pretty amazing. And uh, there's a couple of other guest artists that join in. I won't say that in case this is seen before Tuesday. You'll have to mm -hmm. tune and see, but that was a great close to the show. Tell me, we're getting kind of far into the competition now. What are your predictions for the finals? Well, I think the prediction, I think rumor definitely is in the finals. Mm -hmm. uh, and now that Derek's injured, uh, I think the other spots are, are open for grabs. I think uh, Nastia has a chance. I mm -hmm. think uh, Willow has a chance. Riker has a chance. Um, I, I guess those are my top. But I, I would say it for me, my prediction for certain in the final is rumor. And then the other ones, I think it's up in, it depends on how they dance. So the judges. Now, they're sometimes a little bit controversial. What do you think of the judges' comments? I think their comments sometimes don't align with what's happening. But for the most part, I think what they say is pretty much the same thing every week, just in, <laughs> just in different words. I mean, they're just giving, they're just giving you an opinion of yeah. their opinion of, what they, of, they, of the dance. And that's, I mean, that's what anybody's going to do. I don't always agree with it, but... I'm sure if I was a judge, somebody would say the same thing about me. All right, Cookie. Well, thank you so much. Thanks, guys, for watching. Take care. What is the name of your website? Where is the blog? So it's Diva Darv. Yes, Diva Darv. D-A-R-V. You can get me on Instagram. It's on my Instagram, you know, like underneath there. Yeah. You can just click on it. It's pretty easy. Just doing all fun stuff about the show and catching up with everyone where I can. Getting a bit of backstage goss for the guys back home. All right. I've got you guys covered.